Hello, this is the video tutorial for the Star Wars team. I will show you how to install it, which apps you need, what settings you need to use, and everything you need to successfully set up this team. So first of all, here is the team. You have uh, multiple pages. Each page contains uh, four apps at the bottom here you have Google Apps, your main apps social stuff and media, music, pictures, camera, Skype at the, at the top you have uh, information hub it shows your uh, location, the weather, the temperature the date and all kinds of stuff there is a separate uh, character from the Star Wars movies on uh, each hub. So here you have Yoda, R2-D2, the Dead Star, Darth Vader. Um, and in the middle you can set two pictures on each page. You can choose from 24 pictures I think or 23 I'm not sure. But I will add more pictures in the future. I chose uh, a couple of nice ones here also I have the other pictures um, set up so you can see some of them you can choose your own pictures which ones you like and use them in the team so first of all what do you need for this team you need two apps so we're going in the play store you need to search for UC, excuse me, UCCW, Ultimate Custom Widget. You really need this app because the team is made for this app. So make sure you install UCCW. And after, make sure you install Nova Launcher or Apex Launcher. It's free. There is a free version and a paid version also which includes even more features. So UCCW and Nova Launcher. After you have these two apps, go into Nova Settings, Desktop, choose the Grid 7x4, Width Margin None, Height Margin Small. These are the settings I use because there are so many different screen sizes and resolutions you can just uh, use try uh, different settings until you get the perfect uh, layout here you have scroll effect I use the card stack one and in dock make sure the dock is disabled and in look and feel make sure the notification bar is disabled you can also go into gestures and buttons and set for the home button when you click it to take you to the app drawer so I'm going to show you when I press the home button it takes me to my home screen I don't know why Oh, on, you have to turn off only on default screen. So now when I press the button, I'm taken into the app drawer. Also, you can choose a swipe action. When you swipe down, your notification bar comes down. So those are the settings for Nova. Nova Launcher, you can, uh, you can look for even more settings and try everything out. Now I'm going to show you how to add the widgets on my S2. You just go to a blank page, a black wallpaper by the way. Go to add widgets. Ultimate custom widget and choose your size. All widgets are 4x2 or 4x1. So I'm just going to start with 4x2. Now you will see a list of all uh, Star Wars skins first you have uh, the Google Apps skin 
you have your four hubs different ones you can put at the top then you get your pictures so there are 23 and at the bottom you have the other three uh, app widgets so these three and the one at the bottom at the top this one are the wi are the app uh, widgets and these four are the top hub widgets so I'm just gonna add um, Darth Vader one or no R2D2 one so that needs to be at the top oh I already had it now. anyway that's the way you can add widgets so these are all 4 by 2 and this one is 4 by 1 now after you add the widget on your home screen like I have here and you press on an icon you will be taken into the play store if you have hotspots mode on so let's go into UCCW the app itself so this is the app press the menu button choose hotspots mode if this is on you are taken into the apps but it's turned off by default and you will probably see this when you first press on a widget so as you can see this is an editing uh, menu here you can choose your own hotspots so let's say um, for calendar you use a third party calendar or you want another calendar not the standard one it's hotspot 2 so you choose hotspot 2 press on here you can choose any app or shortcut you want also UCCW actions which include uh, launch alarm or dialer as you can see more things so you can choose your own apps so I'm just gonna do it again for the calendar choose app now the list is loading with all my apps just choose calendar so can set up your own apps and when you're done you just press the back button on your phone so you can do this with all the four bottom uh, widgets and when you're done you go into the app itself UCCW hotspots mode turn it on and now that it's on you are taken into the chosen uh, apps so as you can see they all work So that's the whole idea. Now, um, also in UCCW, when you press settings, you can choose your uh, location, how often the app updates the weather, Celsius, or if you want Fahrenheit, you can just unclick this and it will be displayed in Fahrenheit and other stuff. Now I also want to show you one more thing. I'm going to turn off uh, hotspots mode again because I want to edit a widget. If I press on this widget, you can see I can choose the time format which is right here. So if you don't use this time format, you can for example just choose another one and it will be displayed in this format so you can also change that now uh, so you need UCCW you need Nova Launcher uh, make sure you run Android 4.0 or higher because Nova Launcher doesn't support anything lower than Android 4.0 so Nova Launcher UCCW, you need to set up Nova Launcher with the settings I showed you. Then just add the widgets to your home screen. You can choose the hotspots like I showed you and then just set it up like you want it. You can of course change everything, put it wherever you want. So that's all up to you. I just provide all the tools. If you have any other questions, feel free to email me. I will answer as soon as I can. 
If the skins don't show up when you're adding UCCW widgets, make sure you email me because I will send you a simple fix and then it will work for you. So please don't leave a one star rating in the store. Just email me and I will help you. So that's it. Thank you for watching.